Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the Pixel Lab. In the last tutorial, I showed you how to add dirt to the lugs of this Jeep tire, and I did that with our plugin called Pixel Plus Dirt. But in this tutorial, I wanted to show you how to do it if you don't have Pixel Plus Dirt Rig. All right, so we're gonna dive into mixed materials in Octane and figure this out. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is add a mixed material. So if we go to our materials, we have diffuse, glossy, specular, and we have a mixed material. A mixed material is basically how we're going to combine two different materials into one. So let's take this and drop it onto our Jeep tire. We're gonna go ahead and add a blue material to the top one and a red to the bottom one, just so that we can visualize what's going on. And you'll notice that we have purple right now. That's because the two materials are being mixed by this float texture. So this float texture is basically just a black to white gradient and it's going to expose these materials below it. So if we go to our float and move it all the way to the left, you can see that we're only showing that red material now. If we go all the way to the right, we're gonna only show the blue and then everything in between, it's sort of like an opacity slider. So that doesn't really help us because we wanna show the dirt only in the lugs of this tire. So we need to specify where it's going to be. We're gonna clear this out and instead we're gonna use a dirt shader. So under amount, we're gonna to go to C40 Octane. We're gonna to go to dirt. And this is going to find the little crevices. So if we go into dirt, you can think about this just as a black and white map, which is gonna show what materials show up where. So if we increase the radius and the strength a little bit, you can see that now the red is showing up in the little crevices and the blue is showing up in the other parts. Um, but what if we wanted to add a noise also? So if we added a C40 octane noise, we might wanna add a bit of this kind of a pattern. The problem is we only have one slot for mixing these two. The good news is we can actually add a mixed texture into this slot right here. So if we go to C40 Octane, we can actually click on Mixed Texture. And then we have two texture slots in here. So we're kind of going down the rabbit hole, um, but stick with me. We have two slots in here now so we can load up our dirt that we were talking about before. So load up our dirt. And then in the second texture, we can load up noise. So C40 octane noise. And now just like before, we are mixing between these two with an opacity slider basically. So let's say that we want to dial in the dirt first. Let's drag it all the way to the dirt slider side. You can see the dirt showing up a little bit. Let's go in here and dial it in, increase the radius a bit, maybe the strength, maybe the details. You can play around with that. And then we'll go back, we'll move our amount all the way over to the noise. Then we can go into our noise and start playing around with that. We can play around with the different uh, types of noise. So we'll just go with turbulence. We can play with the octaves. We can play with the contrast. We can play with the gamma. So just kind of dialing in exactly what we want this noise to look like. Maybe drop those octaves down a little bit. So something like this is kind of crazy. I actually think I like Perlin better. So let's go back to Perlin and Anyway, we'll just do something like that for now. So let's go back and let's mix these two by going back down the middle 50%. You can see that we're getting the dirt and also that noise, but I wanna kind of lean more towards the dirt side and just have a little bit of that noise pattern. All right, so now we can back up and then we can replace our material one and two with the actual materials we want now that we've set this up. All right, so the blue one will be the rubber, so we'll just replace it with the rubber. And then the red one we can replace with this dirt. And there you go. Now we have dirt showing up in the lugs of this tire. I hope that was helpful. If you guys have not used mixed materials yet, they're very powerful and fun to use. Uh, definitely check out Pixel Plus Dirt Rig if you're interested. That kind of takes it to another level with a lot more options and it's a lot of fun to play around with. Also, this Jeep was modeled by my friend Remco and uh, he's allowing us to give it away for free at the Pixel Lab. So I'll put a link below for you to download it. And I'm also including a Octane version now, which I just retextured in Octane. So that's it, our gift to you. Happy New Year, everybody. Thank you for supporting our site and we'll talk to you next time. Ciao.